famous Lao artist Teb Ta Won Suk staged an exhibition of some of his artworks under the title Monsoon Country in order to raise funds for schools through auction. According to him, the charity school for kids in Laos was set up by his friends and other people living in Canada who had a special fondness for Laos and wanted to help children in rural areas to have access to quality schooling. Of the umbrellas. So that's the June Ray painting. Now, again, saffron row paintings. This is really typical Buddhist and Lao, but mostly for me because we live in Long Prabang. Visitors to the exhibition had the chance to study the wide range of works on display and make bids in a silent auction for either of the two works that were available to buy. The proceeds from the sale of the two will go towards supporting the charity School for Kids in Laos incorporated in its efforts to help develop schooling in Vientiane province. The exhibition features a series of paintings using oil or watercolour on canvas and pastels and ink on rice paper for the 21 works which reflect the lifestyle, culture and atmosphere in Long Prabang province where he has had his gallery for a long time. According to him, the two works being put up for auction were mixed ink and watercolor painting on paper from Taiwan and an oil on canvas. Minimum opening bids in the silent auction were set at $1,500 US for the watercolor and $2,000 US for the oil. The auction started at 6.30 p.m. and both works were snapped up. The proceeds go towards the extension of a lower secondary school in Vieng Kham village in Vieng Chan province. The exhibition, Monsoon Country, illustrates life in the rainy season here and from the style of the painting, one can easily make out whether the subject is Luang Prabang, monks and temples, clouds or rain, or the Mekong and local women. Monks in the morning, in the mist, in the fog, at about 6, 6.30, almost like apparitions. Teb Tabon Suk himself spends half of each year in Luang Prabang and half in Canada, which he has been doing for 10 years as a means of inspiration for his creativity. His art has been on exhibition in many countries around the world, promoting Lao culture and art since 1979.